Um, Aaron Watkins, we're here at the ninth annual Bushwick Film Festival, and I'm here with uh, film director uh, Romas Zubarowskis. Did I say that correctly? Can you say yes, that's right. So, yeah, Romas Zubarowskis. Okay, I'm, I'm American. I did butcher your name, but I, I, I did get it uh, better a little bit earlier. In all fairness, I tried it. Awesome. Okay. Thank you. It is so amazing to have you here. Can you tell us what it means to have your, your film premiere here in America? Well, thank you very much and of course I'm very happy and humbled that it premieres at Bushwick Film Festival because first of all, Bushwick is like one of the greatest creative hubs in the whole world. So like how cool is that to be part of it? And um, it's a great festival, it's growing really fast, it's impressive and so I'm very happy. Okay. Now, without giving away uh, too much, can you tell us a little bit about just the motivation for why you decided to shoot this film? Um, well, <laughs> it was a difficult uh, time in my life and it was a way for me to um, discuss uh, who am I, you know, the questions of my own identity because the film is kind of autobiographical in a way. It's about a gay filmmaker from Lithuania who is helping his friend, an actress, to escape uh, the country after she kills her mother and steals her money. So, okay, that's a bit, uh, maybe not everything is autobiographical, but, um, but for me it was a way to discuss the notions of celebrity, of fame, of art, and uh, it was truly something very personal and artistic that I wanted to do. Well, uh, I, I definitely look forward to seeing the film, but you know, can you tell us as an as a openly gay uh, LGBTQ activist, you know, what would you say is the current state of affairs for LGBTQ um, you know, citizens in the Baltic states? I think it's going uh, better and worse at the same time. Worse because we still have a lot of homophobic initiatives in our parliament. We still have some homophobic speech, etc., and hate and intolerance, and we don't have a, a lot of progressive laws that we need to have. But at the same time, it's going better because people start to uh, fight uh, for their rights to speak up. More and more people are becoming open and visible, and so that is very cool. And I'm equally proud to be part of that. Okay, can you tell um, just our viewers, you know, what do you say to, to young filmmakers who are struggling to sort of find their identity and find their voice uh, in this industry in 2016? Well, I think the film industry is changing a lot and there are all these possibilities to shoot uh, cheap, uh, digital and also to find your own community, find your own people who would support your work truly. So maybe rather than thinking of uh, doing something that would suit the taste of everyone, maybe it's better to think uh, how can I suit the taste of someone like me, someone, like a very specific taste to do something very uh, like unique and then you will find your community, your voice uh, and uh, it will work out better than before.